Apple's recent update to iTunes, they've made some changes to the way the apps get updated. I'm Donald Bell, and in today's how-to, I'm gonna show you the new way to update apps in iTunes, as well as a few tricks for updating just the apps you care about. Now, when you open up iTunes 11.0.3 or later, click on the Apps tab on the side, and you'll notice that the button for updating your apps has disappeared from the bottom bar. You also get these lovely ribbons on all of your outdated apps as a gentle reminder that an update is overdue. So how do you start the process? Well, up here above the app icons, you'll notice that the categories have changed to include a category called Updates. Click this, and you'll see a selection of just the apps that had update ribbons on the previous screen. You'll also notice that the Update All button has finally returned down here at the bottom. But before you tap it, if you're dealing with dozens of updates like me, you may want to just selectively update only the apps you care about. To do this, you can click on any of the apps, read the details about the current update, and then tap the individual download button if you think the update is worthwhile. To download a small group of apps, select them with your cursor or click on a few while holding down the shift key, then right click and you'll see an update option for just the selected apps. That's all there is to it. For more tips like this, head over to howto.cnet.com. You can also find more from me over on Twitter. For CNET.com, I'm Donald Bell.